Hi everyone. This video, I'm going to teach you guys how to build a reliable CCTV security camera system with a POE switch and a UPS. So why a POE switch? Well, compare with the router, POE switch versus adapts POE technology. And with POE technology, the power and data transfer through one single Ethernet cable. So when we connect our two cameras to a POE switch, we just need one Ethernet cable, and that's all it needs. We don't have to worry about the power sources next to it. All we need is, even if it's like 50 meters away, we just need a 50 meters cable and connect it to the POE switch. And each port has like 30 watts of power output, so it's pretty much enough for any IP camera for surveillancing. And it also has a wide bandwidth for all the data coming back. And it's really small, the power supply is integrated inside, so it's really easy to deploy in any places and won't take much space. This one has four ports, but if you have a lot of cameras, you can go up to eight ports, 16 ports. This is just a very standard POE switch in my hand right here. So that's the benefits of the POE switch. Now let's take a look at how we can make a very reliable one. That's because we have the UPS. The UPS stands for Uninterrupted Power Supply. So this power supply is between our power source and our like adapters, uh, our power sources for the monitor and VR POE switch. Uh, it's between it, so when something happens to our main power source, like for the building or for a house, this can use its battery inside and power our whole system for a few more minutes. This gives us enough time to handle the crisis, come up with a strategy and solve the problem. So it's a very good backup solution when something sudden happens. And we don't have to really like worry about it. We all have to, there's not a lot of settings. All we have to do is make sure when the battery is full when the power outage happens. And when everything's done, you just plug it back in and it'll keep on the waiting mode for the next crisis to come. So now I'm going to show you guys how to put this whole thing together. Step one, I'm going to connect our POE switch with our, PO, with our NVR. This is for us to see the image on our monitor later. The NVR is a network video recorder. It can help us process the data and show it on our screens. And then after that, we're just gonna connect the IP camera to our POE switch. And then we should be getting an image on our monitor shortly. Now we have an image on our monitor. Next thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna keep moving my hand here and I'm gonna unplug it right here. So unplug our battery, our power supply. And you can see the UPS will keep this whole movement on so it means there's zero interruption. You can see that? This means this whole system can operate for a few more minutes even if I unplug the power source. And this UPS right here will keep its, use its power to power the whole system for a few more minutes. And once I'm done with everything, I'm just gonna plug it back Plugging it back will interrupt with the system as well. So you can see how cool this is. Now, yeah, we can use this in a lot of places when we have to monitor very important rooms. And since people, when they have bad intentions, they'll have to try from getting their hands on sabotaging the power source. So if they sabotage the power source and they think they're okay, they're safe, this whole UPS will keep the whole camera from running a few more minutes for us to get a clear look at the, uh, the criminals and that will help us a lot. It's going to be very precious information. All right, that's pretty much it for this video. If you guys have any more questions, feel free to leave them at the section below. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.